gangster. Hello guys, happy Sunday. Today is February 25th and we're back in Long Beach again at Shoreline because we're going to go on a Long Beach glass bottom boat tour. Essentially, it's a one hour tour where there's a glass bottom and they're going to take you on the port of Long Beach where you can see the beautiful marine habitat and the kelp. Yeah, they're going to talk a little bit about it too. So yeah, I'm really excited. That'll be me. <gasps> So dock 7 is over there next to Tokyo Wako. So we have to check in 30 minutes earlier. Oh, I believe, yeah, that's the boat that we're gonna be going on. Sea view. It's a tiny one. Hi, uh, checking in for the 11.30. Here's our boarding pass. We have to come here five minutes before the departure time, which is 11.25. So, what'd you think? It was really nice just feeling the breeze in my face. Mm -hmm. I know they talked a little bit, but honestly, I just wanted the ride to, you know. To experience it. Experience yeah. it. One thing I do have to compliment them about is that they keep the boat very clean. Mm -hmm. I feel like I've been on other boats or cruises and it's kind of like sticky mm. or it's like an old boat and then there's like a little smell. Yeah. But this boat was fine. Yeah, it's fine. It's clean. It was clean. Well painted and not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. How about you? It was fine. I mean, I know you expected a lot more fish, but I mean, this is uh, Long Beach. It's not like a tropical area. So the type of fish that we saw were like gray and, you know. Uh, we saw like a couple orange yeah. ones. Yeah. Yeah. The Ghirardelli. Ghirardelli? Yeah, that, I yeah. think so. Yeah. Yeah. Garibaldi. Garibaldi. 
I also do like that they gave us some fish food to attract partake and attract the fish. That was like an extra bonus. Yeah. Out of 10, what would you rate it? Out of would 10. you go again? I don't think I would go again because I already went. Okay. It was more for the experience. So like 6.5 yeah. out of 10. How about yeah, you? I think I'd say that too. I mean, fortunately the weather wasn't too bad today. I mean, you can see it's a little like June gloomy over here, but at least it wasn't raining and it wasn't too hot, so. Yeah, and the guy was very friendly. He came around teaching us, telling us about what the fishes were. And then when I was on the top, he was like, oh yeah, these are the three islands. And he was telling about like what they're gonna do with that. And mm -hmm. he was very nice, friendly, informative. Yeah. So, okay. All right, bye guys. Bye. Hi guys. Hi guys! Today we're in LA because we are going to an event called Hip Hop Infinity. Tell Infinity. Oh, Hip Hop to Infinity, yes. So apparently it's gonna showcase like the 50 years of hip hop that's been going on. Mm -hmm. I'm not very versed in this, so. Me neither. But we're just checking it out because uh, it looked interesting and we'll get to learn the history of hip hop. Okay, let's go. Let's go. You know how in LA we're always complaining about graffiti? Yeah, that's part of the hip hop culture. You're a gangster. Oh, gangster. <laughs> that's a cool pose, I don't even know. I Do mean, like there's some it? songs I like, but you know me, I'm more of a classic rock kind of guy. QR code, it will show you the prices. I think it actually used to be in the New York City and it came here to LA. Oh, interesting. I feel like I know him. Do I know him? You don't know Coolio? I've heard of the name, but I don't know like the picture of the rapper. He, he sang the song Gangster's Paradise. Oh. That's him. Oh, that's, that's him? Yeah, no wonder I know him. He's Jay Z. I was like, yeah, he looks familiar, but I think this is like the younger version. Of course. Yeah. You like that thug life, honey? <laughs> you know who that is? Oh, it's Tupac. It's Tupac. Oh. And then now. Yes, it is. Mr. Slim Shady himself. Why is he Slim Shady? I don't know. That's his name. You know who that is? Biggie. Biggie. Like those grills. I know who that is. He lives in our he lives in our neighborhood. Nicki Minaj. Yeah. I didn't know Queen Latifah was a hip hopper. I just knew her for being like an actress. to create your own mix. Oh, that's so cute. They have it all doggy eating because of Snoopy Dog. Los Angeles. Oh, you like how they vandalize all the freeway signs like this? Nice. And yeah, but you know, the graffiti in LA. Maybe we can get some on the way home, huh? That's like a nice scenic view of LA. Wait, what's this phone booth? That's a payphone. You don't know what a payphone is? Oh, they're talking about the, the graffiti. The graffiti on payphone.
like a mixing board actually is. Yeah, you really gotta know what you're doing. Yeah, well, there's so much to touch. What does this mean? LA. Uh... <laughs> Goodness, that must be so painful. The hand is so sensitive. How would you feel if my hand was all? Uh, not my style. Really? You don't think it's cool? It's not my style. Wow, what's going on in this loud music gallery here? Okay, remember how in the exhibit they graffiti the freeway sign, but that's part of the culture? We are driving through LA and yeah, the culture is to ruin government architect and buildings with graffiti. That's the culture. Oh my goodness, over there. My goodness. Ugh. Yeah, coming up, there used to be a really famous nice mural. Look at all the graffiti. God. It was of like little kids playing sports and then was it like a promise that? Yeah, I think it was some prominent uh, either gang or whatever like they contracted them to actually make the mural and for a long time it was kind of like a agreement like hey like let's not touch this this is you know whatever but Low Lives decided to just you know graffiti the graffiti. Right <laughs> 